In this video, we're going to write the electron configuration for Hg. This is mercury. We'll also write the electron configuration for the mercury 2 ion, Hg2+. Mercury is a little bit challenging. When we look at the periodic table, we have mercury here. This 80, this is the atomic number. It's the number of protons. And because we don't have a negative or a positive, this is neutral. These protons are going to equal electrons. So we have 80 electrons we have to account for when we write the electron configuration for mercury. So here I have the electron configuration written out for mercury, and we're going to use this chart here to show how I did it. If we look at the chart here, we start out with 1s2. S can hold up to two electrons, so we have our 1s2, we go to 2s2, then we go to 2p6. P orbitals, they can hold up to six. There's our 2p6 term, 3s2, 3p6, 4s2, so we're just going along until we get to 80 electrons. All these numbers up here, the superscripts, add up to 80. 4s2, then we go to the 3d. So we go 4s, 3d. D can hold up to 10. 3d, 10. 4p6, 5s2. From the 5s2, we go to the 4d, right here, 10. 5p6, 6s2. From the 6s, we go to 4f. f can hold up to 14. Here's our 4f. 4f goes to the 5d, and we put 10 in that. And this is the electron configuration for mercury. All these superscripts add up to 80. That's the number of electrons. Often, you'll see it written a little bit different. And this is OK to write it this way as well. What's different is that this 6s2 here, we now have it after the 5d. So we've moved the s's after the d's throughout here. The reason that's helpful is this 6s2, these are the electrons that will be lost when we form an ion. So if we wanted to write the ion for mercury 2, Hg2+, plus, we could do this. The 2 plus, that means we've lost two negative charges. We've lost two electrons. And we're going to lose these electrons right here. So if we just take that out, this is the electron configuration for Hg2+. Down here, this mercury here, we would just take the ones off on the end of that, and that would give us the electron configuration for Hg2+. So the only difference between mercury and the mercury 2 ion, we just lost those two electrons in that 6s2. This is Dr. B with the electron configuration for Hg, mercury. Thanks for watching.